So as you notice, I have a chair and a stool next to me. These can be used as easier ways to help in, in stretching and movement and some assisted exercises. So I want to show you just some ways that you can use general household objects to improve your daily practice. It doesn't even have to be in a yoga or a movement class. I find myself doing it throughout the day when I just want to stretch or get into a joint and just release something or move around a bit. One of the most easiest ways to improve your health is movement. So let's just see a little bit how we would work with these. In this particular version, we have a few benefits to it. One is we have this pretty high back. You can see my hands can actually go beneath it. There's another way we can use it as well. If we turn it around, maybe I want to touch my toes, but I'm too stiff in the back. Well, I can use the chair like this, or I can also go here. Now I'm getting the same motion that I would get if I was pressing into the ground through the back muscles here, just by reaching into the chair. So it can be wonderful for that. I can walk back further to change the angle in my body. From here, I can also use the top of the chair, changing the, the variations on how uh, I can stretch it and what I can, what I can do. The same can be said from the back side as well. I can use that as a support to lean into. Something to remember on the back side is I don't want to use too much weight as I may push it forward. So finding what that is. It also can be great next to you to, let's say you're working on a tree pose, but your balance is, uh, you can use this and sort of say, okay, I have the support here. Maybe you work to get away, you start to fall, you work that, or you just stand here like this. It's not important how you, how you get up there, it's more working that. And if you need assistance, it's very easy. There's lots of things we can do with a chair. With the stool, you have a similar thing. Now, one of the benefits of the stool is it's usually a little higher than a chair. It's not as high as the backrest, and not as low as the sitting part. So this gives you a few options. Similar like the chair, you can use it to lean forward, right? step back. Some stools like this, you might have the ability to use the, the rings around it. You can also grab the sides a little easier sometimes, so there's different motions where you may want to grab the sides. Lots of benefits with that as well. So these are two options for accessories you can bring in either into your yoga practice or just into your daily life. Like I said, a lot of times I will come in and just find props around the room, tables, dressers, beds, chairs, and use them to help me move into my body a little bit easier, stretch, go around, whatever it is. So I, I really recommend using these. And you'll see in some of the later exercises I offer that I will be bringing these into those practices. Hopefully this brief explanation is helpful for you. Please let me know if you have other utilities, other chairs, other whatever you're using. If you have some questions, send them on to me. I'm happy to give my advice and see if that helps with your journey. That's all for now. Don't forget to subscribe and like all that fun jazz, and I'll see you when I see you. Peace.